<clears throat> Good afternoon. It is Monday, May 31st. Uh, it's about quarter after five. I'm just sitting in the parking lot waiting for my eldest to get off work. Um, so I did a post on my community thing uh, last night. Know if anybody saw it or cares or whatever but to expand on that um i uh <clears throat> did a test video today on the new camera that i got um just um in the house holding on to it. it's just a tiny little tiny little thing um but I thought that maybe I could hook it to my rear view mirror or um, if that doesn't work out, I'll have to order a, like a suction cup dashboard deal. Um, but I did do a quick test with that camera. Um, and then I realized, um, my buddy has been working on my laptop. Um, I've got an old, really old laptop, um, that I used when I went back to college. Uh, but I haven't used it since. So it needs everything updated, like all the drivers and what have you. And, um, so I did what I could with it. I'm not that great with tech stuff. So... My buddy has it now. He's going to see what he can do with it. Um, but when I did this test video today on the new camera, um, I realized that um, I have to wait until my youngest goes to bed to download it onto my desktop so that I can view it and uh, see what it sounds like and all that kind of stuff because the, the, the sound through the camera when you look at it through the actual little tiny camera, um, you can barely hear it. Um, so I'm hoping that that's just because of the way that everything is on that camera. <laughs> I'm going to download it to my desktop tonight and check it out and see what the picture quality is, what the sound quality is. Um, and then I'll have to hook it up to my rear view mirror with one of the, it came with like a whole crap ton of different um, holders, but it's more like, like a GoPro kind of deal. So it's like, you know, you can put it on your wrist, on a wristband or on your jacket or on a handlebars. So I'm hoping the handlebar one will be able to kind of Mickey Mouse it onto my rear view mirror. And I want to try a test video with it hanging. Um, but I have a feeling that I'm going to have to get a suction cup dash thingy for it, um, which is fine. Um, it just means that I'll keep filming off my phone for a while. The other thing that I noticed was that filming off my phone, um, when I, um, figured out how to go in and view my videos, um, on YouTube because... I didn't want to go in and click on my channel because then it gives you like, um, I think it gives you like fake views or something and I don't want that. I don't, yeah. Um, but, uh, I figured out a way that I can go check stuff, um, in the editing. Uh, like I said, I'm really bad with this stuff and I'm still learning how to navigate, uh, the YouTubes as far as, um, creating videos and stuff so bear with me there is a learning curve um but I, I i noticed that my videos off of my phone look like they're off of my phone if that makes sense the cropping is all weird and um i also figured out how to put the subscription banner and sorry people distractions um i figured out how to accidentally 
figured out how to get the subscription banner up and suggestion videos um, to show. Um, so I set that up. I went back and put that on all my videos uh, the best that I could. Um, but I think that because it shows like a vertical video, um, these pop-ups or whatever they are, like they take up the whole damn screen. So I tried to get it as close to the end of all the videos as possible. Um, but if either of, of my two wonderful subscribers, um, check out these videos, like just skip right to the end of them and let me know what it looks like. Feedback would be fantastic. Um, and the same, once I put up a video with this new camera, I'll put something in my community post about it. I don't know if you guys see that or not. I honestly have no idea. Um, and maybe I'll also put up just a quick video from my phone, you know, like to the, something to the effect of like in, in. 10 minutes, I'm going to put up a test video, you know, feedback appreciated, something like that. Um, but yeah, I mean, like I've, I've said before, these videos really are, are for me, um, especially when I'm trying to sort out my own head monkeys and what have you. Um, but... I, I do have a couple of subscribers and I so greatly appreciate you. I'm, I'm honored by that. Um, and I respect you. And if, you know, I know for me, when I subscribe to creators, um, it's because I've watched at least half of their content and I, on some level, resonate with them whether I find them funny or informative or just entertaining you know um I don't subscribe willy-nilly to just any creator you know I've got lots that I don't subscribe to but I do enjoy their content on occasion like I don't drop what I'm doing to go watch their stuff I do have a handful that I will, unless I'm doing something with my kids, um, pretty much drop my housework and whatever. Oh, they uploaded. <laughs> um, but I'll, I'll give my casual creators that I watch, you know, views and, you know, I try to click on the, you know, give them likes and comments. So, you know, drive their engagement and whatever. Like, I get it. That's, you know, I'll help you out. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so please do, um, I'll try and put something up when I do my test video, with, um, um, with the new camera and, uh, yeah, I'll try and put something out, uh, to give a heads up and if I could get some feedback on the new camera, that would be fantastic, as well as the um, prior videos with the um, cut it or what, bookends or whatever they call them. I don't know. Um, and if need be, I mean, if I can, like if it's really, really distracting and you absolutely hate it, <laughs> I can go back and see if maybe I can play with the positioning of it. But because it's a vertical, like, all my videos to date are basically vertical videos, so there might not be much I can do about it right now, but hopefully I can get this other camera, um, and as long as it, as long as it, the sound is good and the video quality is at least decent, like I don't need perfection, but you know, um, as long as it'll do for a while, um, then that I can fiddle with spacing and um, hopefully it'll be a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. 
if that makes sense. So, I do have a rant that I would absolutely love to do. But I don't want to get into it here in the parking lot because I feel sub I like feel very self conscious when I do it at my house in my driveway. Um, I feel really self conscious about it in the parking lot with like you know eighty or ninety cars in it, people walking everywhere. Um, and I can't help but keep watching everybody. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I also hate looking at the camera. <laughs> just staring directly into your soul. Um, but I'll try and get out um, this evening after dinner. After I make my kids dinner. I'll sit in the car. In the comfort of my own driveway. And, uh, and do a video. A good rant. I think it'd be, I think it'd be funny <laughs> for anybody watching as well as therapeutic for me because it really did piss me off. Hardcore. Hardcore. And I mean, I'm going to tell you right now, it is, it is first world problems. Like, no doubt. <laughs> Not going to lie. It's absolute, absolutely meaningless in the grand scheme of things. But like I said, it pissed me off. So. Twice. <laughs> I'll get into it later. I promise. <laughs> I told my buddy about it yesterday. and uh, uh, He thought it was pretty funny. But he likes it when I get frustrated and go off and lose my shit. He thinks it's absolutely hysterical. <laughs> Can I just say that I'm kind of digging the way my eye makeup is reading, at least on this phone. I... I I, you know, at angles, it looks really good. Yay me. I'm very happy with it. You should see it in person. This eyeliner, it's like an, an electric blue um, liquid eyeliner. And I adore it. I wish I had a matching um, stick liner to to do everything else, but <clears throat> the black actually looks pretty good underneath it, like in the, in the lash lines and stuff, but damn, rather, look at that, <laughs> love it, <laughs> sorry, cringe, you get cringe on here from time to time. <laughs> Anyhow, yeah, I'm just sitting here roasting in the car with my windows up so it's really friggin' hot so that people, you know, they can see me talking to my phone, but they can't hear me because I don't have a quiet bone in my body and if I put my windows down, everybody will think I'm yelling at some, like, they'll think I'm yelling at myself on the phone. And we don't need none of that. This way, maybe they think I'm, like, video chatting with somebody. I don't know. Mm -mm. So I'm just going to sit here and kill some time waiting for my kid. And then we'll go home and make dinner. Which I haven't decided on. It'll probably end up being either fish fillets. Because i got an inhuman amount of various types of fish in my freezer. Or... Um, I think there's chicken strips, chicken fingers, um, because I, uh, was fiddling with that camera a bit this afternoon and then I had to go to the post office and do an Amazon return. Um, don't you hit me. <laughs> My car is worth more than your life, honey. almost backed into my car. <sighs> um, what was I saying? Yeah, I had to do a return at the post office 
and uh, got puttering around. It took me forever to do my damn eyeliner. I haven't done liquid eyeliner in some time. <clears throat> so, and I had to help my son with some, my youngest with some stuff on his online learning. So, um, oh, sorry, this really does, this really does kill my hands. Um, holy slow down, bud. Jesus. People doing 30 in the fucking parking lot. Asshole. They're out in drones today. I swear to God. I was out when I took to the post office. My youngest came with me. Get him out of the house for a little bit. And when we finished all that, um, I said, you know, I'm just going to stop and grab coffee on the way home. Oh, that's a horrible angle. Sorry. Um, I'm going to grab a coffee on the way home. And, you know. I'm going through the intersection and this friggin' twit um, is trying to make her right while I'm going through and she's inching out and inching out. And, you know, she damn near drove into the nose of my car. And, you know, I, I knew I, I could see what was going on so, and I'd slowed right down, right to a crawl. And she's still nosing it and she's looking over where she's turning to and she's not looking ahead of her. Uh, I had to come to a complete stop and honk my horn and she's looking at me like I'm the fucking asshole. With my precious baby in the car, she's lucky I didn't jump out and thump her. Uh, uh, I hate driving. I hate it. I loathe and friggin despise it and then this guy you know in the parking lot here had to be doing 25 or 30 kilometers in the friggin parking lot like you know if my cat light reflexes were on today I would have flipped the phone over so you could have seen that was crazy oh here comes my son all right so this will be a short one and I will try to do another one later Okay, <laughs> sorry I'm looking for him. <laughs> Cringe. Bye.